In the dusky embrace of twilight, a world of mystery unfurled before eager eyes. An enigmatic mansion stood as a sentinel against time's relentless advance, its shadowy secrets beckoning like whispers from the past. It was in this realm that a television screen became a portal, transporting us into the gripping tapestry of the 1966 TV series, Dark Shadows. Do you remember that moment, dear reader, when the ethereal notes of its haunting theme tune first danced upon your senses? The sensation was akin to stumbling upon a hidden realm, a forbidden garden of tales where the mundane and the supernatural waltzed in an elegant, yet perilous dance. Through the sepia lens of memory, perhaps you recall that heart-pounding encounter with Barnabas Collins, a brooding figure shrouded in darkness, forever entwined with a curse that transcended time itself. The narrative threads of love, betrayal, and the undead interwove seamlessly, drawing you into a mesmerizing trance, much like a moth ensnared by moonlit allure. As the days turned into nights, you found yourself inexplicably drawn to the enigmatic Collinwood Mansion, its corridors echoing with the whispers of forgotten history. Who could forget those flickering candles casting elongated shadows, or the tantalizing allure of the supernatural, forever woven into the fabric of this iconic show? And so, as we stand on the precipice of retrospection, ready to unveil the veil of the past, let us journey together into the cryptic realm of random facts about dark shadows. From its unexpected origin story to the unsung heroes who breathed life into its characters, we shall delve into the very essence of this timeless creation. So, my fellow traveler through the tapestry of television history, join me as we unravel the secrets and shine a light on the unsung gems that forged the legacy of dark shadows. Step beyond the threshold of ordinary and embrace the extraordinary tales that have long lingered in the shadows. Dark Shadows, unveiling the enigmatic Barnabas Collins in the annals of television history, few characters have captivated audiences with the intensity that Barnabas Collins did in the iconic 1966 TV series Dark Shadows. Amidst the eerie backdrop of supernatural intrigue and familial secrets, one remarkable fact about this enigmatic vampire stands out like a shadowy silhouette against the moonlit night. For over a year and a half, fans followed the unfolding saga of Colin Sports' enigmatic Collins family, spellbound by their dark lineage. Yet, a peculiar linguistic dance transpired within the narrative. Throughout the show's early episodes, characters alluded to the brooding Barnabas Collins in myriad ways, employing a tapestry of euphemisms and descriptions. It wasn't until the series' 410th episode that the word vampire was at last uttered, unveiling the supernatural truth that had lurked in the shadows all along. This deliberate linguistic maneuver added layers of mystery, allowing viewers to gradually fathom the nature of Barnabas' affliction, mirroring the gradual unveiling of his true identity. But it wasn't only the narrative that held unexpected gems. The show's behind-the-scenes revelations proved equally captivating. Jonathan Frid, the actor who breathed life into Barnabas, disclosed a charmingly mundane secret about one of the character's most iconic accessories, his black onyx ring. Astonishingly, this symbol of otherworldly power was not a relic from some antique shop or a specialty jeweler, but an off-the-shelf purchase from Woolworths. The prop department's ingenious sleight of hand involved painting a plastic green gem black, imbuing it with an air of mystique that perfectly complemented Frid's haunting portrayal. As the series neared its fateful conclusion, unforeseen real-life circumstances further intertwined with the show's narrative tapestry. David Selby, known for his portrayal of the charismatic Quentin Collins, encountered a medical plot twist of his own. Afflicted with appendicitis, Selby underwent surgery, prompting the show's creators to write him out temporarily. However, his triumphant return wasn't merely scripted, it played out in reality. Selby's recovery paved the way for him to star in the final theatrical spin-off, Night of Dark Shadows, a silver screen extension of the TV legacy filmed seamlessly on the heels of the series' end. In the ephemeral realm of television, where stories often flicker, in Fade, Dark Shadows defied convention, etching its name into the annals of cult classics. From Barnabas Collins' veiled references to the revelation of his vampiric nature, from the unassuming origins of his ominous ring to the uncanny real-life twist that led to David Selby's return, the show masterfully wove reality and fiction. A testament to the enduring power of the supernatural, Dark Shadows remains an enigmatic gem in the pantheon of television history. 
Arnab is Collins, the sympathetic vampire who rescued dark shadows amidst the tumultuous world of 1960s television. A gothic tale emerged that forever altered the landscape of daytime soap operas. Dark Shadows, a series of intrigue and supernatural allure, found its lifeline in an unexpected character, Barnabas Collins, the reluctant vampire with a conscience. In a chance encounter between writers Ron Sprout and Gordon Russell, fate intervened on an elevator ride after a pivotal meeting with the show's creator, Dan Curtis. The revelation that a vampire would grace the screen prompted a decision that echoed through television history. With a stroke of brilliance, Barnabas would become a complex figure, a vampire torn by his own morality. This single act, a conscious choice to humanize the supernatural, transformed dark shadows from a mere soap opera into a cultural phenomenon. Originally slated for a brief appearance, Barnabas Collins defied expectations. Portrayed by Jonathan Frid, his brooding charisma and ethical struggles captivated audiences. The show's survival hinged on this unique twist, as Barnabas bridged the gap between horror and humanity. His compassion and moral dilemmas made him the inaugural example of a sympathetic vampire on screen, a concept that would later evolve into a genre trope. The impact was profound. Viewers embraced the newfound depth in dark shadows, launching it into a realm of unprecedented popularity. What began as a daring narrative decision evolved into a saga that captured the imagination of a generation. Arnava's Collins, the quintessential reluctant vampire, saved the show from the brink of cancellation, solidifying his status as an iconic television character. As the legacy of Dark Shadows endures, Barnabas Collins remains an emblem of innovation, proof that even the supernatural can be a canvas for intricate human emotions. His unexpected journey from elevator musings to cultural icon stands as a testament to the power of creative risk-taking, forever changing the way we perceive vampires on screen. So, as the credits roll on the tale of Barnabas Collins and his haunting journey, one thing remains clear in the realm of television history. He is the one who saved the shadows from fading into obscurity. The portrait's enigmatic power unveiling the mysteries of dark shadows in the haunting world of the 1966 TV series Dark Shadows, where supernatural intrigue reigns supreme. The enigmatic portrait of Angelique, a bewitching character of the show, held more than just a fleeting presence on the screen. With its beguiling aura and intriguing connection to the unfolding mysteries, this portrait became a visual embodiment of the show's eerie ambience. Invested with an uncanny power, the portrait of Angelique took on a life of its own. When misfortune befell the character, the portrait ominously faded and cracked, mirroring her plight in an unsettling manner. As Angelique's fate wavered between light and darkness, so did the portrait's condition, heightening the suspense that dark shadows thrived upon. Yet, the portrait's enigma didn't stop there. When Angelique's life was ultimately restored, the portrait underwent a transformation, reverting to its original state in a supernatural reflection of her resurrection. This mystifying interplay between the character's life force and the portrait's manifestation added a layer of otherworldly intrigue to the already spellbinding narrative. Notably positioned in the foyer of Collinwood, the grand estate that witnessed countless enigmatic occurrences, the portrait of Barnabas Collins, another central figure of the show, assumed a significant role in foreshadowing impending events. As the camera ominously panned to the portrait, accompanied by an eerie musical cue, audiences could sense that a foreboding presence lurked in the shadows, ready to disrupt the characters' lives. The portrait, with its silent yet potent presence, became a hallmark of dark shadows a visual motif that encapsulated the show's fascination with the supernatural and the unknown. Its ability to convey a sense of impending doom or imminent resolution through subtle visual cues speaks to the show's masterful storytelling and its enduring impact on television history. In the captivating world of dark shadows, where every glance and whisper held a hint of mystique, the portraits of Angelique and Barnabas stood as symbolic gateways into a realm where the boundaries between the living and the supernatural blurred. Their presence, infused with enigmatic power, added an unforgettable layer to the series' tapestry of intrigue, making Dark Shadows a timeless testament to the allure of the unknown. The enigmatic curse, unveiling the mysterious origins of Dark Shadows' lycanthropy amidst the brooding atmosphere, 
and captivating drama of the 1966 TV series Dark Shadows. One cryptic tale stands out, shrouded in the shadows of Collinswood. At the heart of the show's supernatural intrigue lies the enigma of the werewolf curse, a captivating storyline that has intrigued fans for decades. Though never explicitly stated on screen, the genesis of this curse holds a fascinating secret. The firstborn twin inherits the monstrous transformation. Chris Jennings' affliction as a werewolf, a captivating facet of the series, hinged upon his status as the elder twin. His sibling, Tom, would have borne the burden had birth order been reversed. Unveiling the lineage, the curse traces its roots back to Quentin Collins, an ancestor ensnared in the Gypsy Magda's spell. A forbidden romance with Magda's sister, Jenny, led to Quentin's curse, thus laying the foundation for the agonizing fate that awaited generations to come. In every era, the curse found its mark on the firstborn males of the Collins' bloodline. This intricate tale of lineage and lycanthropy adds an enthralling layer to Dark Shadows, a series renowned for its supernatural twists and turns. As fans delved into the characters' tangled pasts, the curse's hidden origin added depth to the show's mystique, leaving viewers bewitched by the secrets of Collinswood. So, as you rewatch the series, remember the hidden tale of the firstborn twin and the werewolf curse, an unsung thread in the rich tapestry of Dark Shadows' bewitching narrative. As we bid adieu to the captivating realms of dark shadows, our journey through time and mystery draws to a close. The echoes of Collinwood's secrets and the enigmatic lives entwined within its shadowy walls linger in our minds like whispers of a forgotten era. As you take a moment to reflect upon the myriad twists and turns, the supernatural allure, and the profound emotions this timeless TV series stirred within you, consider the threads it wove into the tapestry of your own life. Perhaps you found yourself transported to a world where the line between light and darkness blurred, much like the intricate web of your own experiences. Maybe the haunting beauty of gothic landscapes and the eerie elegance of its characters resonated with your own sense of aesthetics. Or it's possible that the stories of love, tragedy, and the eternal struggle between good and evil mirrored your own personal journey. We invite you to share your cherished recollections, the moments that tugged at your heartstrings, and the musings that danced through your imagination as you delved into the enigma of dark shadows. Your unique connection to this captivating universe enriches its legacy, and adds a layer of depth to the tales that unfolded within it. Thank you for joining us on this exploration of the unknown, this dance with the supernatural, and this journey through time itself. Your time and interest are valued treasures that have brought life to these words. Until we meet again in the realms of fiction and beyond, keep the spirit of dark shadows alive in your thoughts and conversations. Stay mysterious, stay curious, and remember, it's your stories that keep the shadows alive.